Have you heard about this? Four volunteers will soon spend, soon spend an entire year inside a small habitat at Johnson Space Center in Houston. It is all part of a program to better prepare mankind for future missions to Mars. Jason Miles has a look inside. Mars may be 145 million miles from Earth, but missions to the red planet could come as soon as the 2030s. And so this is a really good insight to see if, if that's even possible. That is CHAPIA, or Crew Health and Performance Exploration Analog. It's an isolation and confinement mission for a year with a crew of four. Four astronaut-like paid volunteers will spend 12 full months in this 1,700 square feet habitat, which houses things like tiny bedrooms, a living space, an area to grow their own food, and a medical bay. We actually are collecting a lot of biological samples throughout this mission to, to uh, evaluate health. This is video of the 3D printed structure taking shape inside a large warehouse. The crew will be monitored 24 seven, performing simulated spacewalks and other activities, only without a lack of gravity. This area is called the sandbox and is meant to mimic the Mars surface. NASA even went as far as to dye all of this sand. It's really wonderful how we can go up to a year, uh, isolation and confinement with a lot of resource restrictions food, water, things we're expecting from Mars to be restricted. Psychological and physiological impacts are among the things that will be studied before data then helps design future Mars missions. The volunteers taking part in this mission will be revealed in the coming weeks. At Johnson Space Center, Jason Miles, KHOU 11 News.